This is Air Guns Nirvana with a DIY night vision update. So some months back, I stumbled across a YouTube channel, Rolaids Bench, and what he was doing for DIY night vision really inspired me to build what you see before you here. I made a few tweaks in comparison to what he, he's been doing, but uh, he has really excellent information, good info on cameras, monitors, illuminators, all that good stuff. I didn't feel the need to go back over any of that because he has done that job excellent, better than I ever could. I'll put a link in the description to his channel as well as all the necessary details about the components here in the build. I've made a few tweaks to the design, uh, but it's really a, a simple setup. There's a black and white IR sensitive bullet type security camera an accessory rail, a way to mount the accessory rail to the optic, a battery pack, a backup monitor, as well as an IR illuminator for being able to see in complete darkness. So one of the first tweaks I made was I nipped off the these leads from the camera as well as, excuse me, from the monitor as well as the ones from the camera. I soldered the power leads directly to the leads coming from the camera and the monitor, weatherproofed all that. I'm using an 8 AA battery, battery pack here. I have a plastic tab that isolates one of the batteries from the pack so when I remove the tab that's what allows the system to power up. I took and I epoxied two accessory rails together that allows for an accessory rail on the top and an accessory rail on the bottom. On this particular air gun I have an additional accessory rails that mount here to the optic for mounting the monitor as well as the IR illuminator. Another tweak that I made is before I used a regular scope ring mount that you would normally mount a scope um, to a gun that was mounted here and this is how the accessory rail is mounted. After playing with that for a bit, I decided to drill out the threaded part of it and turned the base into a cap. So I was wanting to show how simple it is to transfer this night vision setup from one air gun to another. On the IR illuminator, I have one of the rail caps on it. it. Allows me to stack the monitor on top of the illuminator. With the single mount here at the base, the entire setup is removed from the air gun. And ready to be transferred to an oven. This is my nighttime dedicated 2250 bird slayer. It's necessary to remove this dust cap on this particular air gun to allow the rail to index over the top of it. The entire setup mounted like that. It was because of this particular scope, since there's no room to add additional accessory rails or anything, 
is what got me to thinking to drill out these bases and use them as scope caps. So off that one. Then on to my long range. So just like that. There's a little tab. Powers right up. Lightweight, compact. I couldn't be happier. I hope you enjoyed the information that was given. Please feel free to post questions and comments. I'll do my best to answer any question I can. Thank you and have a good day.